So now I can show you how to pair this uh, Huawei uh, watch fit. You can see here I have to connect to this watch and I'm using my Mate XS here and I will go into the Huawei Health app. I will go into devices. I can click on add here and then I have the option to uh, choose smart watches and it is updating the list and I have here the Honor Watch ES which is basically the same watch as this one without GPS and I have the Huawei watches here and I can choose Huawei Fit series I say pair I say allow and there we have it it is pairing now and it asks me if I want to accept this request I say yes pairing is succeeded and I can auto download update packages over Wi-Fi and turn on auto update and hit done and then I have to see how far I place it for the best um, measurements in terms of heart rate so two fingers here oh, no it was one finger here and yeah it's okay and that's it you can see 79% um, battery already and it is connected and I have the option to choose watch faces here I can go into health monitoring everything is enabled like the true sleep technology which allows me to uh, set the, uh, the, the or to, to simply monitoring my sleep the activity monitor is enabled continuous heart rate monitoring is enabled and uh, so on so here you can see the default watch face which shows me the weather it's raining actually it shows me my heart rate which is a bit higher right now no ah, it's lower it shows me the uh, uh, date the day and the watch uh, face also shows me the time and if i tap on it you can see it's changing colors i can go to the right to show me my uh, heart rate and i can go to the right again to show me stress levels uh, I have to enable the automatic stress test in Huawei Health for this. I can show uh, the weather. Currently it's raining 15 degrees here in Auckland Central. I have a music control here and I have activity control here which shows me my steps um, and the time sitting I think or something else here. I don't know what this is rest time and yeah we're back here. We can click on the uh, one button that is on the Huawei uh, watch fit and we have the option to go into heart rate monitor which has some further options uh, like here heart rate zones that it can show show you we can go in SPO2 which can show you the it's measuring now keep still it's showing me the um, oxygen uh, in my blood oxygen levels in my blood measuring keep still okay keeping still you can see it has a progress bar slowly growing which will show my oxygen levels and here you can see 98 percent oxygen levels and a heart rate of 78 which is i think okay uh, then we have some activity records here as well with some more information the same thing that we saw before but it has a lot more information here we go through this of course in more detail in my review uh, has some sleep tracking here as well where you can also get more information about your sleep tracking and we can go into stress level here as well breathing exercises music control and so on so this is it for the Huawei watch fit what I can show you let me go to the dark mode to show you no not do not disturb dark mode to show you the um, model a bit better you can go to watch faces uh, i have to agree here and we have various different watch faces that we can take a look at um, we have um, a simple black one for example this shining one the time one we have digital and analog ones we have this orange moon one and uh, this looks cool whimsical just let's install this one and just tap on it and it will be installed and you can see there are various different watch faces that we can choose from and i can choose the ones that i like very much like this here emphasis for example it will be downloaded to my watch automatically and applied after 
it has been down already. You can see there are lots and lots of watch faces, much more watch faces than on the watch, on the Honor Watch um, Magic or the Watch GT. The first, I think, uh, um, Huawei watch uh, based on upon light OS. And you have, of course, the manager which shows the installation process like here and also the ones that are already installed on the device itself. You can see there are quite a few that are installed and I think it installed the new one and you can see here it applied automatically the new one. So this one shows me my uh, steps, my uh, kilocalories that I used, my battery percentage and uh, the current heart rate of course and the time as well. And I have of course the option to uh, with a long press to, ch to change between the various different uh, watch faces here you can see another one uh, what it doesn't have is like something where you press and it automatically jumps into a specific option just like heart rate for example it has this classic watch which looks pretty nice some of the watch faces like this one has the option to be configured and to tap on various different things to go directly into uh, the um, a specific app just like for example the weather app or the heart rate monitor or the step counter or the yeah this is the step counter again and you can configure it by long pressing and going to configure and here you have the option to configure this with something else for example instead of distance calories or weather heart rate stress level for example if you want to have the stress level stress level here and yeah that's it now you have the stress level here instead of the um, uh, calories or whatever that was there before the, the distance that was there before uh, so there are also those watch faces but there are only a few of them of course as always the huawei watches allow you also to firmware update here and i can check for a new firmware update and uh, there we go a new firmware update is out there it gives you a nice little change log here as well what has changed and uh, we can say update here and it starts downloading the update now in the background and you can see here it will then connect to my watch and start installing the update as well so this is everything for this little overview of uh, how to connect and uh, what watch faces you can see on the Huawei watch fit hope you enjoyed this if you have questions you can ask them in the comment sections that's everything for this video hope you enjoyed it thanks for watching until the next time bye